When we got this case, we discovered that this hospital out in Bakersfield hired really inexperienced and inadequately trained and certified neurodiagnostic technicians to monitor the spine during spinal surgery to provide a layer of safety for patients. As a result, in this case, our client, unfortunately, Charlene McKnight, was rendered a paraplegic for life due to a bone fragment coming loose uh, during surgery and compressing her cord. The first huge challenge in this case was to figure out a way to get around Micra. We made a phenomenally simple, just plain language argument that, look, these technicians aren't part of the code and therefore Micra doesn't apply. And we won at summary adjudication. We were able to recover the tremendous non-economic damages for Ms. McKnight and was able to collect it. We wanted to get these you know, poorly certified, poorly trained technicians from this side of the room all the way over here to, to, to practice where the really the good technicians, the good medical providers were practicing at that standard of care. So you know, the only way to do that in cases like this is just to use the trial, the power of the trial courts. So that's what kind of we, we do for our clients. This client really wanted to try to ensure that other folks wouldn't you know, meet her fate. And this jury really sent a loud, loud message with their verdict that this is not the way that medicine should be practiced in Kern County or throughout the state.